The trouble surrounding the treasure is what's on the agenda tonight. The big question is, will she get bonded or ousted? Lily Cavanaugh is and has been at the center of controversy here in Redford Township. She is a treasurer who is not bonded, so she can't collect taxes. That means if she doesn't get bonded and stays on the job, Wayne County will do the tax collection at a cost of nearly $600,000. And the township supervisor says that more than a half dozen people will have to be laid off to make up for the loss. Lily, wait a second. That's I, I, that's I a rehearse. Have, wait. I have, we tried to ask Lily why she won't step down or what's the problem with the bonding, but we really didn't get answers. She does admit she's had a bankruptcy in the past, a foreclosed house, and it's reported she's had some legal troubles years ago in California. Some people in the township have made their feelings known. Don't put us through all that. Resign. Get going with your life. That's where we will go on with us. It is reported if the township doesn't have a bonded treasure by March 14th, Wayne County collects the taxes and then the fee from the township and then layoff notices will go out. One of the options to resolve this problem is a trustee or a resident could contact the governor, ask him to remove Lily Cavanaugh from office. It is reported that's already in the works. In Redford Township, I'm Cheryl Choden, Channel 7 Action News. Of course.